Brad Mondo. Hey, everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for being here. So, on today's video, what we're doing is we're doing and revisiting the ponytail haircut, but this is going to be a hidden ponytail haircut with a butterfly cut. So, I've done the hidden ponytail wolf cut. The butterfly cut seems to be popping right now on social media. All of you are wanting it more. I've seen it in the comments. Everyone's saying, do more butterflies. So here it is, the butterfly haircut, but with the hidden ponytails. So if you want to get straight to the haircut, you don't want to watch the section in or me explaining it, this is the time you need to head to down here. But if you're interested in the sectioning pattern as to why we do it, stick around because I'm going to explain why we're going to be doing the hidden ponytail butterfly cut. So like I said, we've done the hidden ponytail wolf cut and it seems to be a really big hit with you because it shows you ways in which you refine hair as we do in salon. So I'll do exactly the same. And the reason I do the hidden ponytails is because I put one section, another section, another section. So we're actually going to have three ponytails throughout here that are hidden. Reason four, we cut one, take one out. We cut another, take one out. We cut another, like Russian dolls. So we'll start here say and we'll cut it and then we take it out we've got another ponytail we cut that and then we take it out we've got another ponytail we cut that and it just creates these layers of 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 hair around the face rather than just doing one ponytail and then cutting it and you get all that full which is great i've done a lot of them but the hidden ponytail works because it's like we are pre-sectioning and we are refining the hair all in one so i'm gonna get into the section pattern then i'll explain it and then we'll get straight into the haircut Right guys, so that is the ponytail in, and it just looks like the old fashioned Brad Mondo unicorn haircut, doesn't it? The unicorn haircut, which is just one ponytail like that. We cut it and then we have layers, but all is not what it seems. We have three ponytails in here. So what we do is we cut one, take it out. We cut another, take that out cut another, take that out, and then we've actually got a beautiful butterfly haircut that is all custom, custom lengths, because we're actually taking sections, but this looks as if it's just one. Now, the sections come from two inches back and they end up just right at the hairline, just here, so straight over. If you want me to, right at the end, I will draw the section and pattern on here for you. So if you want to see the section in, that will be right at the end of the video. The next one is from the high point to behind the ear. And then we've got all of that hair then taken up into the third ponytail. So you can just see, it just looks like a bog standard unicorn, unicorn haircut. Let's get into it. So for everybody that is skipped to this part you're in for something special for everybody that watched the section in and, and for me to, to talk about how it's going to look i can't wait to show you this so because we've got three ponytails in there you're going to create layers at the back you're going to create texture through the middle and layers and you're going to create shape at the front stunning right scissors in hand we're going to elevate to a 45 degree angle, which is there from the head, 45 degrees. So, the first ponytail is what's going to affect the back of the head. This hair is so heavy. Are we ready? So not only does this cut affect the layers, but it also affects the length. And because it's all over directed forward, we're going to maintain all the length at the back and it's going to get softer and softer here around the front. So there's our first cut. Now, it's quite blunt and there's a lot of hair in there, but don't worry because we're going to take another section and another section but you can just put your fingers about an inch and a half back and just get your scissors right in there and soften off as if you were softening a section in the salon. Like that. There we go. So there's our 
first ponytail. Let's take her out. Number one. Or for all my Spanish followers, numero uno. All my French. Oh, there's our first section. Still lovely and long because of how the hair was pulled all the way forward to the front, over directed. We're maintaining that length. Now, in all my videos, people will say, you're not going to take the wispy ends off. We could do, or we could leave them. You can't see them because the hair is so long. I'll just bring it up so you can see. But I need to then put it back down again. There we go. But see, I really like tapered hair. I think it looks really natural. How you get that sort of soft taper. It doesn't look like extensions. It looks really, really lived in. But we could, we could take off a little bit of length if we want to. Let's get on to the ponytail number two. Now this is where, here it is. Still a bit of that at the back. But can you see the layers? There, watch it fall. There. Beautiful. Right, next ponytail is what's gonna give us some more layering and texture. Again, we're going to elevate 45 degrees, but there's not as much hair here now. And with butterfly cuts, they're not as severe as the wolf cut. So I'm not gonna be cutting anywhere near here. I'm gonna be taking this off, probably another two inches, and then I'm gonna use the, the chin as my guide. So we get these beautiful butterfly layers. Gosh, it's just, it's just, this hair is so, so thick. Right, for all the ASMRs out there, are you ready? Oh, right, another two inches off. Now this hair is super, super dense. So we're gonna need to soften off in here. Just going to stand on the stand because the, the, the mannequin is just so heavy. I'm going to just deep point cut right in about an inch. Just going to go in. I just want to be softening off that edge. And why am I elevating? Elevating to get the underneath, but also elevating to create softness. We want to create a bit of softness in there. There we go. There's the next one. Let's take it out. Are you ready to see some butterfly layers appear? I'll just clip that out of the way so you can start to see how it is developing. Let's get her up again. So all of these beautiful butterfly layers that are all happening all through here now i hope you can see but absolutely beautiful you can see through there look at it look at look at the amount of hair this mannequin has got absolutely outrageous and there's people out there using volumizing shampoo and this mannequin has got all of this look at it bloody loads of it now this is what's going to affect the front Are you ready? Final ponytail. Do you like how they all magically appear? Amazing, isn't it? Right. Now, we're gonna go to the chin. There, there. Yes, yes. Magic, right. I know where we're going because I'm a professional. Okay. Chin. Check twice, cut once. Chin. 
45 degree angle. ASMR. With that Brad Mondo comment, I'm going to get all of his uh, super fans saying, why did you badmouth Brad Mondo? I wasn't. I just said, a standard one ponytail unicorn haircut. Nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with it at all. It's just on this channel, we do more. Fun fact, actually, a few years ago, I was on Dutch television. They used one of my videos and they used one of Brad Mondo's videos. So we're basically work together. So we're not, I'm not, I like Brad. He, he's brought a lot to the table when it comes to influencer hairdressing and everything like that. There we go. I just want to show you that as well because of how soft it looks because of all of that texturizing. Right. Last one. And now for your favorite bit, the little shake. This is what we do with models. Put your head forward. So look, she's gonna put her head forward and we're just gonna get under here and we're gonna do our, our hairdressing thing where we sort of like, Titivate it. We, oh, this is going to look so good when you uh, throw your head back. Throw your head back in a second. All right, you ready? Just yeah, keep keep messing it up. I'm going to keep on messing it up. And then what we're going to do is you're going to flip it back, and we're going to get the shots. And get the shots. All right. Can't get nothing done because there's so many parts in this hair. But that is it raw. Let me just judge it up a little bit. Actually, let me just hold it there a second. I'm just gonna get a little bit of spray because then I'm going to add some curl to it so you can see exactly what it looks like. Let's get some product, a little bit of Joico humidity blocker there. And there we go. What I'll do actually, on the next video, I'll show you how I've tongued this and styled it. Because to be honest, a ponytail haircut doesn't, I don't need to style it. What I need to style is the ones that are salon. But just so you can see, how do you like it? Looks great. I'll get out of the way so you can see everything. And I know what you're all screaming at now. You want to see the back? There you go. All the layers in there. Yes, granted, we could. I will cut it off because everyone's going to be going, bloody cut them ends off. So, well, I am doing a hush haircut after this. So, I don't want to take too much of it off. Right, I'll try and do it backwards. So, there you go. And now there'll be people saying, I preferred it with the length, but it's okay. We'll do another. But there we go, guys. All the layer that you want from a butterfly haircut. Something really floaty and big and bouncy. And she loves it. But you can, I hope you can see all that layer and everything that is around the face. I'll turn it that way so you can see. Hang on. There we go. You can see that shortness there, shortness there. It all blends. Beautifully. Reason four, the three ponytails. We needed the three ponytails to be able to get it all to blend. Because when you do a normal one ponytail, because it's all brought forward, there's so much coming off the front, not much coming off the back. So you don't, you just don't have a connection. But there we go, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. That is the butterfly haircut, hidden ponytail in three. The three, well, not the three, two hidden ponytails, but one. But yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments down below if you have. Um, yes, she's got abundance of hair. It'll work on every hair type. Just got to be very careful with how much you're taking off. But your stylist will tell you that. So until next time, thank you so much. And I'll see you on the next video.